Isaiah walks in with one of the girls from Casa Amor, you will be single. If he walks in alone, he will be all yours. Are you ready to find out? Okay, let's see. Welcome back to the villa, Isaiah. Welcome, Phoebe. Thank you. How are you guys doing? Doing good, doing good, good. thank yeah. you. A bit fucking nervous, of course. Yeah. You should be. What have the last few days been like in Casa Amor for you two? It's definitely been a bit difficult for me. Um, I came in with my door a little bit cracked and she definitely stuck her foot in and kicked it open a little bit. And I definitely just came to the conclusion that I'm gonna be giving her a chance, for sure, so. Sydney, how you feeling, girl? I feel like I was just like hit with a semi-truck. I feel very betrayed. I just thought what we had was more than that, but I guess I was wrong. I still have a ton of feelings for you. I'm just genuinely trying to figure out what I truly want and what my heart wants. Do what you need to do. Just really sad right now, so but I'm not crying this fucking makeup off. I know my worth. A girl like me doesn't stay single for long, so. Okay, Sydney, you are single, so you can sit down. <laughs> Phoebe and Isaiah, congratulations. Please take a seat. Courtney, you are now single and dumped from the island. Please say your goodbyes. Bye. Love you guys. Courtney, she's just the most genuine person I've ever met. She was just a huge part of my happiness in here, so, um, yeah. You did so good in holding her. <laughs> I wasn't even expecting to get emotional, but it's so sad. Like, we came into this together. She's been there with all of us since day one, and it's going to be really hard. She's definitely going to be missed. Bye, Zane! I love you too. At least you went out looking sexy. <laughs> Dead. Love you so much. Love you too. You did a great job here. Thank you. A lot of respect for you. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> I'm really happy for you. Thank you. Yeah. Honestly, I am sad to see Courtney leave. I couldn't, I guess, give her exactly what she wanted, but. You know, I wasn't going to take away somebody else's opportunity to find a connection here away because of the fact of keeping Courtney on when she's, you know, had her time here. But I'm excited to keep getting to know Mackenzie. I think that, you know, there could be potential possibly. I'm 
was like talking to Sydney and like being there for her and then she was like dad how are you feeling and, like Chaz mentioned in the kitchen that like why did we save you like you're not really giving it your all and all this and like what like why didn't we save his sister when she actually had a connection with Jeff and all this and now I feel like I'm robbing people from their experiences like no. obviously Bria I just feel like everyone's forcing me to be someone I'm not like I don't move at this pace mm -hmm. I mean, I'm trying to give Jared a shot, but I miss Andy. I just want to start by saying that I love every single one of you so fucking much. Um, you know, this experience has been so, like, amazing. Like, truly, like, I have learned so much about what I want and what I don't want out of a relationship. I've learned so much about, like, what I deserve and, you know, like, I told myself I wasn't going to cry, but here I am crying. <laughs> as much as I care about Jeff, I feel like for myself, it's not what I want right now. and. I don't want to be here anymore, you know? I think it's my time. It would be so fake and dishonest of me to move on with y'all, knowing that my feelings aren't fully there right now. I want you guys to have your moment. You all deserve it. You're all so fucking deserving of this, you know? And just know that I wish you all the fucking best. Yeah, I want to say the same, man. Like. I do wish all y'all the best, and yeah, I just think it's best that my time is up. I appreciate y'all, for real. Every couple's not gonna be the same. Every couple's not gonna navigate the same way. Mm -hmm. And I think for y'all, there's so much good there and there's so much difference also. And that's really gonna have to be solved outside the villa. Yeah, I definitely feel like I feel hurt, bro. That shit don't feel good, man. When you like ask a girl, you let's be exclusive. She just says, no, she's not there yet. You know, you like, it's like rejection. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. 